Hello, today we're going to be talking about Bright. This is a Netflix original movie that was just released on December 22nd and it's uh, available on Netflix now. It stars Will Smith, Joel Edgerton, and Numi Rapace. And this is a movie basically, um, it takes place in an alternate universe or an alternate earth where orcs, uh, fairies, elves, magic have been around for a long time and in this particular movie it's about two cops played by Will Smith and Joel Edgerton and Joel Edgerton plays an orc and you know he's all in makeup you can barely tell it's him but you can tell from his voice and the way he talks kind of that you can it's a f it's familiar anyways and um so he's pretty good in this like he orcs are basically strong but dumb not too dumb because he was able to get onto the police force but in some ways more more naive than dumb but uh, it's interesting the way they do it because they don't give you a big exposition dump about how this world exists uh, more or less they give you like through the opening credits uh, if you watch there's a it, there's a vehicle that drives by a lot of graffiti and they cut shots to all this different graffiti and the graffiti tells the history basically of what happened you know about how 2000 years ago there were orcs and elves and there um, was some something called the dark lord and orcs kind of fought for him and so uh, now 2000 years later they're looked at as the bad guys basically and it, it deals with a lot of stuff I mean there's the elves are the, these rich elite people so and uh, the orcs are like these brutal thugs and you know so you can get some tones of you know racism and uh, there's a lot of uh, like social classism that kind of thing so it's really good in that respect uh, Will Smith does a really good job. He's not, it his part in it isn't as a comedian, so it's not like Bad Boys or something like that. He's more serious, uh, more along the lines of, like it, it actually uh, reminded me a lot of Sixteen Blocks, where Bruce Willis had to get most deaf to uh, the courthouse to stand trial or uh, testify, and uh, it's a lot like that with the, where you have like the police and the FBI and you also have other gangs trying to get this magic wand that they find out on their regular patrol because they end up finding an elf who also has a magic wand and the the title bright is uh, people who can handle magic wands who the, this elf can do that so there's a lot about like prophecy and this was all in the trailer there's prophecy, there's uh, the cops going bad and trying to get the wand because they know that it's magic, it can fulfill wishes and they want that obviously for, you know, one guy puts it, you can wish for a million dollars or ten million dollars or whatever you want. And so it becomes a big struggle for Will Smith and Joel Edgerton's characters as partners to uh, get through this part of the city where there's lots of gangs and and trying to get this wand to safety and like I said it reminds you a lot of 16 blocks in that respect and Will Smith and Joel Edgerton they're not friends they're partners and they don't get along and that's kind of a trope that's been used a lot in in buddy cop movies but uh, this one was good it's unique uh, and and uh, other than 16 blocks, it also reminds you a lot of something like Alien Nation, with uh, the aliens actually coming down and being part of the police force and things like that. So there are some reminders of other movies, but this is well done. And David Ayer does the is the director, and it's directed like a standard, well not you know above average uh, action movie. And there's a lot of action. There's a lot of car chases. There's, you know, shootouts in nightclubs. There's fights, fist fights. There's magic. Uh, Numi Rapace plays an evil elf 
who's trying to get the wand for herself so she can bring back this Dark Lord character who will basically rule the earth if he's allowed to come back. So there's a lot to it and there's also like these this magic version of the FBI who's tracking down the wand and uh, cert like I said certain gangs m different kinds of gangs there's like orc gangs there's human gangs they're trying to track down the wand as well so overall like there is a lot of action there's a lot of story the pacing is really great uh, Will Smith, Smith is great in it like there's a few moments where uh, it just seems like he's trying to trying to project toughness in really uh, scary situations where you know he just he wants to project the toughness to get the other guy to back down and thus there are some moments where you're like what are you doing but you know he goes ahead and does it anyways because that's his character uh, the only and he he does have a couple one-liners not very many but Joel Edgerton's character actually has the most humor yeah, um, mostly from his uh, being naive about some things so there's some humor there but for the most part it is an action movie it's a buddy cop action movie where they don't get along and then they have to get along because of the situation they're put in uh, they have to protect a person who's an elf in this case and also an object it's, it's the magic wand so um, it's not something you haven't seen before as far as the base story but the way it's done with the elves and the fairies and the orcs and the magic, like that makes it pretty original, especially combined with gangs and cops and and you know the earth weapons basically. So it is a it is a world worth watching for sure. Lots of good action. Uh, the acting is great. The directing is great. Um, there's the cinematography is great. There's couple of editing mistakes you can see but not very much mostly during the uh, the chase scene the car chase scene uh, you can see a couple of spots where you're you're a little confused about what happens but that's because of the editing choices that were made and you know there's a really good slow motion shot but they saw, show most of it in the trailer if you haven't seen that but most of the action is fast paced other than that so that is bright a uh, Netflix original movie starring Will Smith, Joel Edgerton, and Numi Rapace. And I'll give it a thumbs up on Netflix. And as far as a Netflix original movie goes, I'll give it a 9 out of 10. And it's definitely worth a watch. and uh, uh, Very entertaining. And it's a world where I hope they go back to it and explore it more. Thank you. If you like this video, like, share, subscribe, or all of the above. Thank you and have a nice day.